Hello everyone, Juicebags here, and welcome to a little World of Warcraft. Now I am about to use my free level 90 boost that came with the uh, Warlords of Draenor expansion. And I just wanted to kind of show everyone what to expect. Now, um, with the boost, if you're going to boost a character that's over level 60, you're going to get two primary professions and your first aid leveled all the way up to max for free. So how awesome is that? Now, uh, one of the characters I desperately missed on this account was my Death Knight. I haven't played the DK in quite some time, and the reason is is it's on a separate account, and I don't intend on using that account any longer. I'm just going to keep uh, just this one account going. So I wanted to get another DK going, and I figured, you know, DK starting at level 55, that's uh, pretty quick to get to 60, so why not... Um, go ahead and just level them up to 60 and get my profession squared away as well. So um, I went on and started a DK here. I did it on the live stream with Tipsy um, earlier earlier today. And uh, I've got that DK to 60 now and I went on and trained up uh, some blacksmithing and enchanting. That's the two professions I am going to use. And then of course we've got the first aid locked up already. So uh, from this point, if you go on and log back out to your character loading screen, after you uh, after you pre-order uh, Warlords of Draenor and or enter your code or do whatever, you're going to see this little 90 character boost logo on your character loading screen right above here. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, click that now. At this time, you got a chance to choose one of your other characters. Now, you see I've already got a whole bunch of 90s. Um, I do have an 85 mage, which um, I'm not going to do anything with at the moment. And then, of course, we've got my 60 death knight. Or, of course, over on this side, you see you can create a new character. Now, uh, I'm not going to create a new character. I'm going to use the DK. You see the bonuses you're going to get here. I'm going to get a bonus to enchanting up to 600, a bonus to blacksmithing to 600, and a bonus to first aid to 600. And we're going to let this DK roll as unholy. And then just click that level up button. Are you sure you want to boost this character? You can't change your selection. That is correct. And ba bam Juice Bags is now a level 90 DK. Let's pop on in and check him out here. Now we do get a level 90 set of gear and everything, you, all your current gear is mailed to you and you're going to show up um, at your appropriate Pandalan city. Uh, in this case we're at the Shrine of Two Moons. Now you see all our bags got swapped out with 22 slaughters. I'm um, obviously going to need to make some improvements there but that's a huge jump over what uh, we were using. And then if you check your mail, all your stuff that you had is in the mail there. That is your uh, entire inventory, I believe, including the bags themselves. Um, anything you had is going to be in your mailbox. Now, the free gear we got, of course, is all greens. But as you see, it's item level 483 greens, which um, are complete garbage at this point. But it does give you a base that's much stronger than a fresh 90 that just got their leveling. Uh, you're not going to have a uh, item level of 483 if you uh, leveled up legitly. And from this point, you can just head on over to Timeless Isle and get yourself more free shit. Of course, we need to uh, add in some talent points. And then we see our blacksmithing, enchanting, and first aid are all up to the max. Now you do have to uh, go through and learn the recipes, but uh, two of the main ones that I was looking for is the socket bracer, socket gloves. Everyone knows I mainly focus on PvP when I play, uh, and good to see we already have those squared away. So there's a quick look at boosting your character to level 90 with the Warlords of Draenor expansion. Oh, hello. Time to go get me some more hello. free shit. Thanks for watching.